Hello Year 10 and um, a little look at question 29 which um, proved difficult the first time I went through this section B but I think I figured it out so she has $58 in a money box in $1 and $2 coins if there are 37 coins all together use an equation to find out how many $2 coins she has now the way I did it was actually using more than one equation so we'll see we go so what I knew was that uh, 37 times the number of coins is this 37 coins 37 that represents a coin equals $58 and then figuring out how to tie in this $1 $2 idea so I thought okay well I use uh, X number of coins that would be since, since they're a dollar x times the number of dollar coins that would be the same as x dollars for every one dollar coin there's a dollar and then there's a different number of coins that are two dollars and so say there's ten ten two dollar coins the amount of money that is is twice twenty dollars so two y in dollar terms if there's ten two dollar coins you get twenty dollars then I thought okay well if we add up the number of dollar coins and the number of two dollar coins we get 37 coins so that's in money that's the number of coins and then i thought okay well if we add up x and 2y this we get the dollars X is the number of dollar coins, Y is the number of two dollar coins. Dollar coins and two dollar coins is 37 in money terms. The number of dollar coins and the number of two dollar coins has got to be 58. Okay, so that's the number of coins and that's the dollars. One dollar coins, two dollar coins, dollar coins and twice the number of two dollar coins is $58 then I thought okay well since I've got them here what if I combine these two I'm going to combine them by taking one away from the other doing a subtraction in fact I think I might swap those around just to make it so there's not negatives happening so they have the large number on top so x plus so this is our num money how much total $58 the number of dollar coins and twice the number of two dollar coins it will give us $58 but the number of dollar coins and the number of two dollar coins in total is 37 coins so that's dollars that's coins and now I can subtract combine these together by subtracting so just subtracting so I get rid of uh, a variable yep so I'm going to take this one away from this one okay I'm going to do the numbers first remember X is the number of dollar coins and Y is the number of two dollar coins so 58 minus 37 subtracting and I hope you don't get this sort of question in the, t in the test. 58 minus 37 leaves 21. Uh, 2y minus y leaves just 1y. And x minus x is nothing. 
So we're left with, when we subtract this one from this one, we're left with the number of $2 coins is 21. And that's the answer.